I honestly don't want to see the youngin locked up at all. The people gonna probably think I'm crazy when I say this, but mm. I don't want to see YB behind them walls, bro. I think that there's way more available options out there to help him. You know what I'm saying? Change. Get a little better, bro. Not for that nigga. <laughs> black man giving up on a black man, Young bro. boy black is man a giving young, up on a black man, bro. Young boy is a young Louisiana gangster nigga that's not going to change. giving up on a black man. <laughs> this nigga's not going to change on his own. Smooth, we can't be giving he up. He not going to change on his own. How many chances this nigga got? So you, so you think he should go to jail? He needs to sit his ass down. Uh, at, yes, at a, at a psych facility or he therapy not, or like, I, he I'm not, saying like. He not going arrest. to that unless the judge be like, this is, this is, all right, we gonna let you out. But this is some, here's the check checklist, this nigga. You gotta go to fucking uh, rehab for three years. That nigga's not gonna do that. So you think he, you think him as himself, he gonna just be like, I'm just gonna go do my time in jail? No, I'm just saying he, he not, if, if, if you giving him stipulations, he, bro, he, he ain't gonna change, bro. That boy, he dig it, it's not gonna change. Boy, some black. people, some people need to go sit down. Black man turn this black on a black no, man, man no. crazy. Son. Sometimes the niggas need to go sit down <laughs> to change, bro. <laughs> and he one of them. <laughs> you gotta see that, bro. Bro, why he one of them? Ain't gonna be meaning no whole what? Like, <laughs> like, bro, I'm saying who he bother. Just, just, that's what I'm saying. He can't bother nobody when you're on house arrest. Smooth, when you think about all the addicts, like when you when a, when a white person come out like a celebrity, I'm talking about, yeah. and we find out where they are addict, they got buku sympathy for these people. <laughs> no matter what wrong they done did, what kind of what you kind of drive. About... Justin Timberlake was it was reported that the nigga was driving and <laughs> drunk. He might he might have had some cocaine in the system and all yeah. that. Man, what no everybody wanted to see that man free, bro. Justin Timberlake is not no gangster. <laughs> young boy ain't Tell no gay. That nigga ain't no gay. Who he who he who is he beefing with in Utah, dog? Take young boy, take young boy off that house arrest, and I guarantee that nigga wouldn't be in Utah. He'd be back in Baton Rouge <laughs> on Louisiana Street. Yeah, I don't think so. At the bottom, I guarantee you that nigga still be trying to shoot at niggas. Why be when he wouldn't be back in BR? He'd probably come to somewhere like Houston. Yeah, yeah, he had uh, a house in Houston, but I get yeah, but uh, like, them niggas would always go back home. And still be in the streets. The nigga was in a high speed chase in Baton Rouge, le hit, wrecked, left the car, and still got running bro, when you, look, when you bro, were a multi millionaire. Like, oh, there. Listen, look, look at Fredo Bain, come from the same cloth, right? Yeah. And you look at Fredo, Pharaoh's figured out that, hey, I got a career, mm -hmm. I got shit to live for, like, I'm finna tour these streets, live, station myself in Miami, enjoy my life, and bro, stay away from that dumb shit. <laughs> What like, if took, he can do it, bro, why be good? Like, you acting these niggas is the same for, age. What it took for him to get there? All his, his partner, niggas, all his niggas got killed. I was about to say, his partners died. Then my point is, like, I'm just talking about from a mentality. There's an mm -hmm. example of somebody who came exactly from the world yeah. he was in. Like, and we know that to be a, a fact, mm -hmm. right? And the man, now he's just, he in his own world living his life. Yeah. I I believe I don't know if we've give if there's been an opportunity that's been given to young boy like I'm talking about you know real not just put you on house arrest and you lucky this time we're gonna show love and there's no stipulations and there's no like basically you gotta go seek all the help on your own. I'm talking about court order nigga I'm I put that nigga on house arrest for life until you can show and and prove. Changes like there, there, there. He just was on that prison. Is all I'm saying. He just was but on that. I could though. be wrong. He just was on that. He was on a house arrest and the nigga faked the pharmacy for it sixty times. <laughs> the nigga, <laughs> some niggas don't change their way, bro. No, you, you they, listen. There's a whole lot of there's a whole lot of accuracy to the point you. But I'm I'm just saying that I'm I'm questioning have we really given this man an opportunity to change change. <laughs>